Hey guys, it's One Boy Unboxer, and I'm back with a kind of, um, it's kind of a review to honor someone-ish. This is, I have two Iron Man sets. This is, this will, there will be a spoiler for Endgame, so if you haven't seen Endgame yet, which, why haven't you, you can click away now, but this is a spoiler for Endgame, not the sets, but what I'm going to say. This is a video, I want this I wanted to put these two together for a video to honor Iron Man since he died in Endgame. So I have two Iron Man sets. I have the Avengers Endgame uh, um, Iron Man and Dummy uh, Polly bag. And then I have the the Avengers um, Avengers Tower, which, which the way you would get this is, I don't know if it's still going, but... The way I got this is you have to pay $75 or up to get this, to get this with your purchase at Lego store, at the Lego store. I don't know if it's still going on or not. I'm pretty sure it's not. So I have, so I wanted to show both of these off to honor Iron Man since he died. We'll start off with Avengers Tower, why not? So this is a, so... This is Avengers Tower. This is the box. This is the front of the box. This set is based. This is a. The, this is a. The first ten years Marvel Senior Marvel Studios um, thing that they did for the first ten years for Endgame. Um, the way I got this is by buying Endgame stuff. So that's how I got this, which is really ironic. But it doesn't have to be Endgame stuff to get this. It can be anything. Um, but yeah, this is the first 10 years set. I wish they did this for every movie leading up to Endgame. Like, made a little scene that was never a Lego set and put exclusive characters like this. I want them to do that. But this set is recommended ages 10 and up. Set number 7, I mean, set number 40334 as a piece count of 211. And, it, and this is for the Avengers. That's the front of the box. There's one side. There's the other side with the cool um, art animation of the figure, which I love how they're doing that now. There's the bottom with the UPC, but you can't order this figure, so unless you buy it for largest amount of money on eBay. There's the top with Iron Man sporting the actual cyber size reference, of course, since he's the only figure. And then there's the back with with the entire set, but in a better angle. So let's move on to the character of this set. Here is Tony Stark. And this set is this set, um what this set represents is in in Avengers. When when Loki shoots him out of the building and the thing like and his suit shoots on, that's what the set is recommending. So what this is is he jumps off and the suit is coming onto him. That's what that's what this figure is representing is the suit flying onto him. He c does come with this clear blue piece holding. You can either make it hold his helmet or his hair piece. I honestly like it holding his hair piece. But he does, but Tony does come with an extra hair piece. But this is what his mask looked like. I don't think this mask really represents his the first movie because it doesn't have these black lines. But I don't, I don't, I'm not picky. He comes with the new HUD that comes with all the new Iron Men. He comes with this smirky look. And then he has, and then... And then this is what he looks like with his hair piece, which is the sleepy hair piece. And then, and then that's, and then this is his torso. I like this torso, how it show it's exclusive torso. And then you have his arm, his Iron Man arm coming on, and then you have his regular hand with some black pair of legs. But like I said, I like his Iron Man face mask. So now let's move on to the build of the set, which is the Avengers Tower. 
It comes with this little drone piece, which is supposed to represent a Quinjet. Right here, it's a little simple build. Oh, it just broke. Oh, okay. See? It has two Star-Lord guns acting as the wings. And, so, and then it's got this clear piece, which is holding it to the tower right there. It's got two of these Avengers logos. These aren't stickers, though. It's got this cool... It's like... It's got this thing where he would stand and they would take off his suit or all of that. Right there. It's got like, it's got the a viewing area-ish and all that. Then you got all of this. Now you can take this off of this stand. I'm going to show you, so you can, I'll show you the stand in a little bit. But you can take it off the stand and it looks a lot better when it's not on the stand. Got these cool door pieces right here. I really like this for a simple build. So now let's move on to the stand. And yes, these other end game sets will come out soon, sooner rather than later. So I don't know when they'll come out. I actually, I actually have two of the Spider-Man Far From Home sets, and one of them. I, the next review after this should be a Far From Home set because that's the only one of them is the only one I have done. So, but here's the stand with this green piece which attaches it right there. But this and then it has this little piece right here where Tony can stand. And either way you want it, he can be holding his helmet or his hair, as you saw, right there, connected right there. And then you got, and then this is just clear black stand. And then, of course, you can, I forget, yeah, do that. And then put your figure on there, and your set is complete. Perfect. So now that I've got pretty much showed off all of that set, let's move on to the poly bag. Ver, the, the poly bag. I will show both of their instructions after this. Here's the front of the poly bag. This is recommended ages six and up. Um, poly bag number three three zero oh, four five two it has thirty eight pieces. And so yeah, this is for Avengers Endgame poly bag. It's the front. There's the back with UPC, so you can order this and all and the Lego Land ticket. So now let's move on to the character of this set. The character comes with this um, clear kind of jetpack piece that connects to this piece right on the back. That connects right here to the back of it so it looks like he's flying. He also comes with these two um, blast pieces that go on his hands to show like he's shooting up. And then he comes, also comes with this little piece that holds blue flames to look like he's flying. They just connect to the bottom of the seat. And yes, he's in his... Now, uh, here's another spoiler for the movie. You're, you're gonna... Just just don't watch this video if you haven't seen it. But these suits... This suit is what makes them go in time to go back and get the stones because Thanos destroys them. Which is his demise by snapping himself dead and snapping everyone away. That's how he dies. But this is his um, time suit, if you, I'm going to call it. Which is the same in every set. And then you've got this, the same, um, then you've got the same HUD. Uh, you have the same helmet from the Mark 57, I think it was what the new one's called and then under that you have the same facial expressions as the Iron Man from the tower 
Except for this one doesn't come with another hair piece. So that takes care of Iron Man. Well, now let's go to the next thing of the set, which is this little dummy, which I think you get another one of these in the Iron Man Hall of Armor set. I think it comes with one like this. But this is a little dummy piece. It has a little flame there. And it comes... Oops. It connects, and it rolls through these. It doesn't really roll or sap, but... It's connected by these little pieces that looks like wheels right here. Simple little build, like every poly bag. It's just a little simple. It's just something for fun. So that takes care of those. So now I'm going to show you the instruction booklet for these. So here's the instruction booklet for the Iron Man and Dummy set. I mean Polyback. There's one through, there's, this is how to build the character. And there's one through three instructions. And there's four through the end. Just in case you want to build this if you find some parts. And then there's the construction. It doesn't have any ads for any of the other sets. But there's that. So now that that's so. So now I'm going to show off the Avengers Tower construction book. So this is a booklet that goes a long ways. So there's the front. And it got, let me find it. It has 53 pages of instructions. And it's got all the pieces in the set and that what to do. And then it's got the back. So that's it for these. Again, I made this. I wanted to do this video out for for Iron Man to respect him, as since this is his last movie since he dies. So yeah, just go watch Endgame. Do it now, not now, but you know what I mean. So yeah, like, comment, subscribe, comment down below what I should unbox slash review next time. Uh, hit the bell, subscribe, hit the bell, all that good stuff. And I will go check out Facemaker Studios. He's reviewed all of the basic figures for Endgame and, and other stuff. And then go check out Christopher Harder's channel. And I will see you all in the next video. And just remember, there's all, just remember, Tony Stark has a heart.